Hello, I'm here to introduce you to the Applied Biosystems Authentifiler PCR Amplification Kit from Life Technologies. Authentifiler is designed to help human cell researchers authenticate and confirm the identities of their cells and samples. The reason behind the development of the Authentifiler PCR Amplification Kit has come from the need for researchers to better understand and track the genetic identity of their cell cultures. Since the development of the first mortalized cell lines in the mid-20th century, Various human cell lines have been developed from a variety of sources, tissues, and cell types, and have played a vital role in helping researchers better understand cell development, as well as its involvement in chronic and acute disease. However, with a high level of variety and complexity of these cell lines, which are being developed and used across many global research organizations, there have been many challenges in ensuring cell integrity and data consistency. Some publications suggest that up to 20% of research journal articles may contain data generated from mislabeled or contaminated cell lines. In addition, there have been many high-profile retractions from top-tier research journals due to subsequent identification of a mislabeled cell line used to generate the study data. In addition to immortalized transformed cell lines, new research has focused on inducing transformed human cells or tissues into pluripotent cells, otherwise referred to as induced pluripotent stem cells. Although this method has lots of promise in the future, the current method requires large amounts of user manipulation and sample handling, which can lead to contamination or the potential for the development of genetic abnormalities, which can greatly impact the integrity of the cell and the data generated. In both of these situations, using cells that may be mislabeled or that lack cell genetic integrity can have disastrous consequences on research results. For instance, it can result in false conclusions being published, difficulty replicating experiments across different institutions, and the potential for lots of wasted experimentation, labor, and public research funds. As a result, many top-tier research journals and grant agencies are requiring researchers to validate and authenticate the identity of their human cells used in their research prior to the acceptance of a publication or awarding of a grant. To help researchers efficiently and cost-effectively track the identities of their cell lines, we have created the Authentifiler PCR Amplification Kit. The kit is a low-cost PCR amplification kit designed to confirm the identity of a human cell used in cell culture or induced pluripotent stem cell research. The kit is based on short tandem repeat chemistry and contains all reagents needed to amplify 9 STR loci plus the sex-determining marker amelogenin from your genomic DNA extract. The kit has been performance tested with various genomic DNA extraction methods from both cell culture samples, cell pellets, and formalin fixed paraffin embedded tissue. In addition, the small target amplicon low size sizes and high sensitivity of PCR enable a high level of sensitivity and performance on difficult or degraded samples. Using a kit like Authentifiler to confirm the identity of your cells can greatly help your research by helping you generate more confidence in your data helping you to troubleshoot unexpected or indeterminate results, and helping you meet the emerging journal and grant requirements to validate and authenticate your cell lines. As I mentioned, the target authentifier loci are based on STR chemistry. For those of you who are not familiar with STRs, or short tandem repeats, they are small repeating elements of various nucleotide lengths that are present in the human genome and commonly used as a gold standard method for human identification. Each genetic loci is highly polymorphic and can contain various different alleles at each loci that differ by the number of repeating elements present. If these alleles are amplified by PCR, the resulting fragments can be resolved by capillary electrophoresis and their size can be assessed to generate a genotype of the allele. Due to the high degree of polymorphism at these different loci, each individual or cell donor contains a highly unique combination of these alleles at their different FCR loci. And this combination generates a unique genetic profile for the individual or cell. The one is an example of the typical STR workflow. Two alleles at the same loci are amplified by conserved primer regions. The alleles with the larger number of repeats generates a fragment that is larger and thus will move slower when run through capillary electrophoresis. This generates two peaks which can be resolved and converted into a specific allele call for that locus. Through optimized chemistry, the use of different amplified product sizes and differing wavelengths of attached detection probes, 
Life Technologies is able to develop highly multiplex kits that co-amplify multiple alleles at various loci in a single PCR reaction. Once amplified, these different amplicons can be differentially resolved through capillary electrophoresis to create a complex genotype of the sample. Here are the target loci included in the Authentifile PCR amplification kit. A total of 10 loci are amplified as part of the kit, 9 STR loci and the ameliogenin sex identification marker. Again, due to an individual's uniqueness of the alleles present at each of these loci, the combined discriminatory power of the kit is on the order of 1 in 1 trillion, meaning there is a 1 in 1 trillion chance of a random individual or cell sharing the same genetic identity. Included in each kit and run with each capillary electrophoresis injection is an allele ladder. This ladder contains representative alleles of the most common alleles at each loci and is used as a reference to determine the genotype of your unknown sample. In addition, a positive control genomic DNA is included with each kit and is recommended to be run with each amplification batch. This ensures the kit and your amplification is functioning properly and you are resolving the appropriate and expected genotype. When developing the Authentifiler kit, like our other PCR amplification kits for human identity, it's critical for us to ensure high-level specifications for data consistency and reproducibility. The two factors of intercolor balance and average peak height are used as a means to judge these factors. As you can see, each of these specifications are falling well above our minimum specifications for reproducibility and consistency. Similarly, it's also important to demonstrate that following amplification of a no-template control there are no reproducible peaks or artifacts that are present and can lead to false positive calls for the presence of a look of an allele. As you can see, at three amplification cycles above our highest recommended cycling settings, we are seeing a very flat baseline with no reproducible peaks that can interfere with your genotyping results. Like our other kits for human identification, the Authentifiler kit follows a simplified and streamlined workflow. First, isolate your sample or cells of interest. Next, perform a genomic DNA extraction from the sample. Amplify the STR loci fragments from the genomic DNA extract using the Authentifiler PCR amplification kit. Once your fragments are amplified, these fragments can be run on an applied biosystems capillary electrophoresis instrument to determine size of the fragments, and genotypes can be automatically generated using our GeneMapper ID or GeneMapper IDX software. Now that you have a genotype, this can be compared against a reference genotype or analyzed further to check for low-level cross-contamination present in your sample. Here is a full genetic profile generated from a genomic DNA extract extracted from a neonatal human dermal fibroblast cell that was amplified and resolved using our recommended protocol. Each loci has a genotype consistent with the expected genotype for the cell. In addition, when a low level of an H9 embryonic stem cell genomic DNA was added to the sample prior to PCR amplification, the Authentifiler kit is able to generate and capture alleles from this low level contributor at both a 1 to 10 and 1 to 20 mixture level. This high level of sensitivity can greatly help researchers when they are looking for low level cross contamination in their samples or cell line cultures. The kit is available for sale now at Life Technologies website. The kit is packaged in denominations of 50 tests and is validated for a 25 microliter PCR reaction volume. The kit contains all reagents needed to amplify the target loci from a genomic DNA sample, which includes a master mix, optimized and balanced primer mix, control DNA, and allele glider reference. For more information about the Authentifiler PCR amplification kit and other research tools for human cell analysis, Contact your local Life Technologies representative or visit Life Technologies website at www.lifetechnologies.com. Thanks for your time and interest in Life Technologies.